Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental health with me, your host, Khadija. Today, I really wanted to talk about do we really get over um, once you recognized or identified that you have working on because to me working on yourself is a is it's a continuous process it's a from now to to the end of the time and so when you notice certain characteristics about yourself or certain emotions that come out about uh, when you're on your journey do you check yourself do you stop and take a, a pulse or do you you know just ignore these signs and I noticed that with me you know there's times when I really really seriously have problems with my fight or flight response you know um, and sometimes it comes when there's something that I need to do that I don't want to do in all honesty uh, or things that I think that, um, you know, I don't really want to go into it, and sometimes I, I have to do, I'm learning to actually stand in what makes me very uncomfortable, and in doing that, my fight or flight instinct kicks in, and I'm left with the decision of which one am I going to choose? Okay, am I going to run away from myself or this challenge, or am I going to stand in it and deal with it head on? And to some people, it may not even be that, may not even be, you know, that for you. But that's my struggle and that's my challenge, and so that's what I deal with. Um, I I have to remind myself that there's really only two emotions: love or fear. And all the other things bounce themselves around off of these two huge, um, these two huge, you know, perspectives. So when I notice that I'm operating in fear, I try to stay in it, um, and sometimes it's difficult, you know. With me, it can come when I have a, a doctor's appointment. It can come when I, um, you know, I'm getting ready to meet the challenge or meet somebody or try to make amends with someone and I don't really know what the outcome is going to, you know, not so much what the outcome is going to be, but, you know, how I'm going to respond in that situation. Um... You know, sometimes, you know, those those type of confrontations can bring upon that fight or flight response. So I really, I'm just, you know, sharing this to say, how many of y'all find yourself sometimes dealing with that fight or flight phenomenon? And what you what you what do you do about it? How do you, um, or do you even acknowledge that your body is going through that? phenomena. I try to feel it and do it anyway. Or just stand in it like I said. Um, there's not there's times I fall short as well. But I want to know do any of y'all experience that? And if you do um, how do you how do you um, combat that? I'd like to hear. Alright? So, share your thoughts with me. I really want to know. You can share this video if you like. Please put like it though. Or give it a thumbs up. I'd appreciate it. Um, and I'll see you in the next video.